Good, fine <clears throat> afternoon, early morning, Sunday, 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 YouTube. It is your favorite goth bad boy, King Cobra JFS, back at you with another video. Welcome. Hi, my name is Chloe Roma, and um, this is my story time of how the father of my kid. Story time on how the father of her kid just got away with almost killing her. What? Time of how the father of my kid just basically got away with um, almost killing me. Let's go. On March 17th, 2018, the father of my kid stalked me downtown in my city for 45 minutes and beat my head in with a baton. I fled him due to domestic violence when my daughter was three weeks old and at the time of the attack, there was two court orders to stay away from me, including an emergency protection order. You know, whenever I see women who get treated like this, it just breaks my heart, YouTube. This is why us men have a, uh, a bad reputation with the ladies. It's because this is, you know... And unfortunately, people are shit to each other, YouTube. They really are. You know what I'm saying? Motherfucker. I gotta wait one more day for the alcohol. That's all right. Tomorrow I'll be doing a drink combination. Uh, Cobra's cotton candy. We're gonna make some cotton candy vodka and get some, you know, a mixer to go with it. And just for the Halloween season, you know, that's... Eh. Believe this shit? Can you... <clears throat> No, that's not going to solve anything. Breathe. You're sitting there listening to your wife bitch about how much she hates Cheryl. In the back of your mind, you're like, okay, if you just like her so much, why are you going to Sunday brunch with her husband? Why would you force me to come along? This guy's richer than me. It's like he's just rubbing it into my fucking face. I know how you feel, honey, but why the fuck did you fucking... Uh... I'm doing everything in my power to keep from losing my temper right now because as a man who has a nasty temper myself, I gotta work on it, you know. I get mad at myself and I get mad at society, and this is the kind of crap that just pisses me off. I tell you what. I'd love to take a ghost pepper and shove it up this chick's baby daddy's you-know-where and just watch him squirm for a minute and then spray his face with bear mace and then take a baseball bat made out of metal and smash his face in and break his fucking nose. And like, you think it's, you think hitting pregnant women, you like doing that, you sick fucking asshole? Okay. I'm gonna have fun fucking with you. So basically he got probation for beating his pregnant wife and then stalking her after she gave birth to their child and then beating her again. What? Grr, dude. So almost killed me, showed absolutely no remorse in court, no jail time. You get to climb that corporate ladder and climb it very, very, very slowly until one day they're giving your boss a golden watch for his retirement birthday and that fucking dickhead that's been fucking with you your entire fucking life looks at you and says, Hey, kid, you did good. I'm going to make you the boss now. We're giving you a pay raise. And you literally sit there and go, Fuck yes! But then when you look in the mirror, half your life has been wasted away climbing the corporate ladder. I mean, people think I'm a piece of shit. Holy fuck. All these fucking country songs you hear about 
women taking his truck, his dog, all his clothes, his trailer, his tractor. Ladies, does your man forget to lower the seat after taking a piss? No puss If he forgets it's you and his anniversary, no puss Ladies, you suck him off and he doesn't give you a warning about when he's about to spurt and you just got your hair done and you fucking get that shit in your hair and it's all over your face and you're just like, oh, what? what the fuck you asshole, you said you were going to warn me. No puss And now I have to spend the rest of my life and my daughter's life doing everything in my power to keep us safe because the system failed to do that. Thanks. <laughs> yep, and as predicted, when I muted the donate to talk shits, the trolls are now donating money to get me to unmute it. I play these assholes like a guitar. It's hilarious. Hey Cobra, have you considered ending your dry spell by washing up with tactical soap and greasing <laughs> your mom's... Yeah, you know what? This troll's mom. Yeah. I would totally fuck this troll's mom because... And then I'd smack her son for being a piece of shit. <laughs> Because honestly, I don't need your donate to talk shit that badly. I got true fans who aren't going to donate money just to talk shit. And I don't do the streams for the money. I do it for my fans, to be honest. If all you, if all you do when you donate your money is talk a bunch of shit, I don't need your money that badly, dude. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> uh... And the best part of it is, it's not as fun when you don't hear it out loud, isn't it? Oh, poor widow twos, I took their toy away. If you sit there and troll an autistic going on 30, who's almost 30 years old, because you have nothing better to do in life, no puss out. And who knows, YouTube, I could find me a smoking hot of age goth girlfriend when I least expect it, you know? Only time will tell. You can't rush a good thing. And the reason why I'm not in a rush is because a lot of chicks here in Casper want to date me. Did I say that out loud? <laughs> yeah. Holy fuck. You know, I got my tactical soap on. I get more subscribers on YouTube. They see a guy who actually gives a shit. And he's a decent guy. And on top of that, he's good looking. Oh shit. And he shreds a mean guitar. Oh. So, when it comes to the dating scene, YouTube, you don't know what um, what people go through. You really don't. Although it is kind of uncomfortable to lay on when it's not made, so I will make it here in a bit. And. Um, now that I'm done painting and carving the wands for the batch, I got a vacuum up too. Yes, sir. And making and carving wands gets a little bit messy. And just by the way, everyone is looking at me. Nothing to lose is a game. Halloween alone and the fault is my own and the fault is my own. I want to heal. I want to feel what I thought was never real. Apparently I'm such a fucking Nimrod retarded fuck I can't do anything for myself. Well, 
Watch the autistic retard make his bed like a normal adult. Don't do that. But that's all right. And then we'll take our other blanket right here. Give it a flick. like that. Toy like a toy guy. And put the pillows back on there. Look at that YouTube. The bed's made. And then take our pajamas and then tuck it, roll it and fold it right there. Right by the pillow in the middle. That looks very nice. There we go. Now we got a vacuum. Because there's wood chips and yeah. And uh, sometimes it's just better to get the hose directly on it so that way it doesn't just stick, to, you know what I'm saying? But, um, now it comes to the fun part, you get to watch Cobra clean his pad, because, you know, apparently I'm such a filthy animal. my apartment cleaning my apartment not sorry Reese's I saw that on PayPal too I was like your PayPal balance is negative 26 bucks I'm like the fuck okay hold up <laughs> let's take care of this real quick the hell is it even about? I have no idea what the hell you were talking about.
Now, yeah, you're not, 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 you